Hey guys, Denise Salcedo here for Red Carpet Report, and today we're at week seven of So You Think You Can Dance Next Generation. This is a petite lady brigade right. again. <laughs> Sorry. And the youngest, and I mean, and the oldest. <laughs> you don't look. No, you look like sisters, so. Yes, yeah. From another mister. From another mister. Well, let's get started with, with tonight because you guys mixed it up with the all-stars and the kids. And I think that that's something can really unnerve them when it's top four and there's so much at stake. How do you think they did? They did great. I, you know, it could, be, it could be unnerving, but they become such a family. They, all, all the all-stars love all the kids, and the kids love them. And, it, and I got to tell you that producers put some good pairings together. It, it was very natural. Okay, I have to ask, what prompted you to throw your hat on stage for uh, JT? Is it his cuteness or his performance? No, his performance. His performance was really amazing tonight. I mean, he was on fire tonight. Mm -hmm. I agree. Do you guys already have an idea of who you think might win, or are you guys just totally no, have no, 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 I don't. <laughs> That's like the question I think we get asked all the time, but I could, I never have an answer because every week it's different. I'm like, wait, oh, maybe that she'll win or maybe he'll win, but I, it's so confusing to me because they're all incredible dancers. You never know. You just never know. They all did amazing tonight, so. Who surprised you the most this, this today? JT. I think because of the Bollywood number, Nicole did not ease up. Uh, that was a very difficult routine, and and seeing how he paid such attention to the slightest little movements was really impressive. And then you know, but they're all impressive. I and mean, I mean, Tate doing salsa. I mean, that yeah, was pretty incredible. I love seeing that her do that amazing. because she always does contemporary or lyrical routine so I love seeing her like just have fun with the salsa it's so cool to see them go out of their comfort zone and try something new which which I'm sorry which showed that it wasn't really out of their comfort zone they right. seemed very comfortable they seem, yeah you know? they did seem very comfortable yeah, they totally nailed it and, you know I know you have a big week yourself you're performing at Dizzy Feet and you have your new SIA video coming out tomorrow you gotta tease us give us like a one good line of what we're gonna see tomorrow um it's an it's intense and I mean, it's just everything that we're always doing that we've always done. So I think people are going to expect to see something that they've seen the same, but it actually is very different this time. And there's a lot of surprises. So that's all I'm going to say. And Maddie, you know firsthand, um, you know, being younger, there's always room for improvement for these dancers. And before this season, the dancers were older. There wasn't necessarily as much room for improvement. So do you have any words of advice for these kids as they, you know, close this chapter? Yeah, I mean, we're getting down to the final, we're just down to the end of it, and we only have one more week left, and as long, even if the kids got eliminated the first week, they still have experienced such an amazing journey, even if they were here for a week, so I think I, even if I, I would be so nervous to be in their position, but it's been so cool to see them grow as dancers. I don't think any of them have been the same dancer as they came in the show. They've all just grown so much and it's so cool to see them grow as me being like a mentor like a friend to them so it's really cool to see them any final words of advice for the contestants you know what it's this is this has been a joyous season for them and equally beautiful for the for the all-stars so I just think that you know they should be very proud and grateful to have had an experience such as this and, and it's onwards and upwards to a, an amazing career Go. Thank you, ladies. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you guys so much for watching our coverage of So You Think You Can Dance. Make sure to give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. And in the comments below, let me know who do you think is going to win. Is it going to be JT? Is it going to be Emma, Tate, or Kita? Let me know and make sure to vote because this is the last chance that you will get to vote for your favorites.